going on, everyone? This is Patrick. We're here with a returning face, the legendary Carlos Farrell, the voice of Don from Gears of War. How are you doing? You know what you're doing. That's why I do these interviews, because I get wonderful introductions like that. But um, I'm doing great, man. I'm just going to hold the mic. I'm pretty good with the mic. Uh, but anyway, uh, no, it's a pleasure to see you guys, man. We're here at LA Comic Con, and uh, yeah, it's been a good weekend. Let's talk a little bit about Gears Pop and this comic. Oh, my God. So I'm, I'm pretty stoked, and I, I encourage... If you have your comic book store, your local place, um, IDW is like a wonderful publisher, but they did, to celebrate the release of Gears Pop Mobile, they released this comic book. Now, for those geeks like me, we don't, uh, we think they're flyers. We're like, that's not really a comic, but it's a full-on comic book. Like, like, oh, it is. Full-on book. And, and there's a Dom story, and Dom's on the cover, so... This is what's up. If you can get your hands on it, get it. And uh, not for nothing, the mobile game is a blast. And uh, it's nice to be involved with something that it's the first comic book about pop figures. It has to be, you know, it's a Gears thing. And, uh, I mean, Gears is on your phone and your pad. That's pretty cool. Now, for some of us, could you explain to us what the mobile game is? I'm so tempted to say it's a game you play mobile. <laughs> um, what it is, it's a strategy game. It is like all, you know, games that you play on your phone and your pad and everything else that's not a console or a PC. It's, you're playing with pop figures, so it's cute as shit. It's, it's um, because they're Gears characters, they operate differently because it's, it's not about, you know, a lot of big performances. It's about strategy and it's about, you know, uh, having all these characters that have different uh, powers. For example, Dom, ironically, is a bit of a healer. And he's actually kind of the best character, if I do say so myself, in the mobile game. But um, no, it's awesome. I mean, the boomer is like Groot, just says boom, and everybody knows what he's saying. And they interact together, which is amazing. So it's just a fun, uh, another part of the Gears universe. Now, recently you were talking about Salt Lake City. You threw the Dom party. Did I well, say that correct? What it was, what it was. Well, Dom party sounds like a fetish party. <laughs> it's, it's, it sounds like the Dom. No, it was not the Dom party. It was a party hosted by the Dom father, me. But it, the party was actually, uh, it was my first, what I call the fanboy parties, a trademark. Um, fanboy. Um, we had our first fanboy party at uh, Area 51 in Salt Lake City during FanX. And it was a great success. I, it's my favorite nightclub. Arguably one of my favorite nightclubs in the country, which is in, tech, in the top three. Um, it's exactly the kind of place that you want to go to after a long con day. But also, if you like dancing, you like leaning into certain kinds of music, we're, you know, it was, it, there's a karaoke room in one side, another side. It's a really big uh, venue. We had, you know, people dancing to New Order and Depeche Mode from back in the day. And, you know, it's 80s night upstairs, so we've got, you know, people unironically wearing 80s clothes and you know for old farts like me it's pretty cool so the Don Father excuse me the Don Father hosted that party and uh, here at LA Comic Con actually we did sort of an incarnation of Fanboy um, the Aftercon party Golden Apple Comics put it on and I hosted that too and um, yeah it's 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 not hosted by Dom it's hosted by me Don Father so it's a lot of fun and one question about voice acting. How do you protect your voice so that when you're prepared to do a session, it, no, there's no issues with your voice? Everybody um, has, oh, my God, look at that joker. Look at that joker. Look at that joker. Joker! You're amazing. Really good. Thank you. Sorry. you just. I see a little baby Heath. Got to say hello. So, um, anyway... Um, the reality about voice acting and about using your voice for anything is you just take care of yourself. Your instrument is your whole body. And that, it all manifests itself in how you, how you breathe and everything. They're really, people will tell you here and there, just take, a, um, take lozenges or eat apples so you don't have a sticky mouth and all this other stuff. That's all true, but really stay healthy and you'll do your acting job. The voice is part of it. It's, it's, it's just be ready and prepared. Everything else falls into place. I, 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 don't, I don't have hints on how to protect your throat. That's, maybe I'm just not that guy. And my last question is, Gears 5 recently came out. i got to ask you, how's the game so far? I know you've played it because you, you also admit that you play the games. I play all the games, and um, it really is something else. I was, I was quoted early in the year saying this is the year of Gears, and I stand by it. Um, if you're a Gears fan... Gears 5 rewards you for all these years of loyalty. It's, we've been in it for 13 years, and there's so much more to come. 
That's a nice way to say it. There's, there's so much more to come. And again, the rewards just started. That's all. And if you can look in the camera and tell where they can find you on social media? Twitter, Instagram, Real Carlos Ferro. It's really simple. Not the real, just real Carlos Ferro. And on Facebook, I think I said this on, your, on the last interview we did. I like friends. Facebook, Carlos Ferro. Thank you again. It was an absolute pleasure. Thank you. And thank you for having me again, guys. Hey, it's Miley Flanagan, the voice of Naruto Uzumaki. Believe it. And I am giving a shout out to Tomorrow Comes Movies. Tune in.